Hello and welcome to Fast the Dark. I already started the recording and then I noticed and I didn't start the recording. So how do I fix this problem now? So Spark in the Dark is a dungeon crawler, a hardcore dungeon crawler, crawler or with permadeath. I already walked around that dungeon a bit and I am at my first rest place. I'm playing a thief class, so I'm very agile, have little daggers and I basically move around about five minutes through the dungeon so it's not that much what you missed. At the rest place we can and light a little fire and we can journal. So have a look at the journal. That tells us a bit about our story. We have notes. Edge of madness. Then found some books which we can read. Every like storytelling is with books. We have ancient legends and all the monsters we have defeated even the one from previous runs. Previous runs. We have an invent inventory where we can collect coins. We have grindstone. Grindstones are good for sharpening your weapons. And the thief can use lockpicks to open yeah, things. We do found a ring of a serpent that gives us poison resistance. And we found a potion, an antitoxin potion. Our armor is damaged, we have a rusty dagger which is damaged, we have a lamp, I will can show you later. I also, on my way here, I found a book of skills. You can study on a rest, so I can study this and learn something new. The poisonous mechanisms constructions. So now I learn to... Um, to understand dangerous traps. And how to disarm them. I told you about sharpening weapons. This is still at 100%. And this dagger needs to sharp. So we did sharpen it. It's good to go. When we finish resting, after resting, you get a little bonus, I think. Cheerful. Opening the door. Thing about the thief is as soon as you go into into crouchy mode you can be more in the dark light armor eight defense for yeah, cool. taking this the thief likes light armor a trap there's a corpse we can light up here. This is really helpful. Because while we're in the dark, we are slowly losing our sanity and substation our health. What do we have here? Fire. Here. Go through here. Yeah, that's where we came from, where we spawned basically. One light. What I did already was basically cleaned that room. And then I walked over this way. And Clean this room. Oh, almost ran into the trap. And then I went over there and then in this direction. Oh, there's a box which I missed. There's a bolt in there. Look. 
Crush the Sword of Justice. There's another lockpick. It's a box. It's an old beggar. Uh, it gives more damage and the buff of bleed. Weak chance of success. So we can try to open this. And improve our skill in lock picking. This is a difficult lock, so it requires a lot more tries. There is really. That is a. Yeah, I didn't expect it to open it on the second try. So the darkness is consuming me. I'm too long in the dark now. Up and turn on the light here. Wait till the debuff is over. Very helpful. Sneak around here. There's a door. Try to sneak up and... Oh, we could even were able to insta-kill him. This armor has less weight. And the same armor class, so... The door. Oh, we found another safe room. Look what's in here. A flask of unknown contents. So, and to determine what's in that flask, we have to drink it. Can be poisonous. Can be. That is great elixir of recovery. That is really cool. Now I can have rest here. Picking the locks. Difficult lock again. Well, that means there might be something good in there. Oh, and the books of skill. That is. Wow. It's uh, everything is like roguelite. Like rogue it's every, every run is random. Light armor, less weight, but also less armor class. I'd say we have a rest and read the books and sharp more weapons. We have the journal again. Secrets of the Orgriff. Not really reading the story. So, can we read here? Poison Weapon Mastery. The book contains an overview of various types of poison as well as the skills of applying it to weapons. Arrows and bolts, you are now better at poisoning weapons, arrows and bolts. That is really cool. Then, what else do we have here? Quality weapon sharpening. The book contains a journal how to effectively sharpen. You study the feature sharpening blades X as well as the properties of whetstone. Better sharpen weapon. Inflict maximum damage on the enemy. That is really cool. I think we sharpen both weapons to get more damage on it. Yes, that is a great thing. Just deny. Skill sharpening. Damage for 10 hits. That's not much. 10 hits, but it can... It can help with certain things. Uh, certain animals. And enemies. Interesting. Oh, almost walked into the abyss. Okay, there's a very broken door. Try to backstep him. Oh, he is tanky. On the light quickly. Coin and lockpicks. Here we another shield person. I can try to open that again. So we gain experience in picking locks again. 
good chance of success. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. So, yeah, you kind of... I'm stunlocked. was able to to lock myself out of it so it's still in the early access game where is it and the spider is gone now that was really weird so if you stun lock the oh, yeah, actually finally know how to get out of the stun lock. Has that happened before? If it's brine stone. It's a corpse. Let's hope we don't get disturbed again and get into stun lock. Open the door. never happened before so you can turn on the light and then can break instantly so we came from here and a lot of rats here Never been in here. Body notes. Corpse. Fiery page. Back with the ancient book. Oh, a flask of unknown properties. Which we which we only use. Oh shit. <laughs> That guy is incredibly strong, that's why I ran. So I know that already. Let's have a look. Flask of unknown properties. Try to determine. Elixir of speed. Okay. The sad thing is now we can oh we can read. Okay, let's let's read the books first. And then we try to take care of that monster. Right way. Notes. A lot of notes. I just look through. Not really feel like reading them. So, inventory. Oh, we have staggering boards. A uh, staggering board could help be helpful against the guy. But all they get is still good. So. We're sharpening them all. Perfectly sharpened. This dagger is still good. On sharpening. And finish this. And we could have an elix elixir of recovery. Uh, recovery. Uh, I want to unload him. Give him the staggering ball.
question is where is that oh yeah we have a lamp by the way And I'm stunned up again. That's ridiculous. Now wait for big guy again. I don't know why I couldn't hit him. Oh, we wait for... That's it. So damn strong. Wait till we full health again. Killed him. See the lamp is uh Did I check that bag? Yeah. Maybe we can check this room finally. Medium armor. Need another light armor to be honest. Oh there's another diary cage. Uh we don't really want to get him. That's where we are now. Never been here. And I just said that's where we are now, but never been here. Oh gosh, not sure if we're strong enough to... Can we maybe? Oh, we can't. I think we're safe here.
Can we reload faster? Two-handed sword. That sword looks gigantic, enormous. Loading the wall. So this guy is okay. I'm I'm surprised. The first time I killed this monster. <laughs> Oh. Look, red, oh, the spider, oh, old dagger, gives more damage, we loot it. And... To die. Oh, there was a dagger. Let's wait for the effects to go away. These spiders get. Really strong. Where did she go? I think that was a rusty dagger. It's not better than the one we have, so. Sneak around a bit. Oh, there used to be a light. The sad thing is that Looks like a powerful spider. Um, you just That is a okay. we have to run because that spider is way too strong for us. Ooh, 
You see everything today. Because I really things I never saw. That spider. Another spider. But we need to rest now because we have wounds and we are tired and yeah. We need to rest. Get debuffs away. Okay. Journal. I'm I'm really surprised about this guy. Fiery of Princeton. So we have the Nis we defeated. We have the Moro. Ah, we do we do now know more about him. Level four spider. Sharpen the weapons. I think we have enough grindstone usages. Sharpen the other weapon. And then we're probably going to. Uh, oh. To sharpen one weapon twice. I don't know where this was possible, but. Ah! So what's. Okay. Very cheerful. We have more mobility. Let's get crack. Okay, that spider is gone. Mm -hmm. Are we going to ring the bell or are we not? Next. Try to kill them from the back. Okay, I've never went one tier lower. Okay. A lot of stuff going on here. Let's ring the bell. Not work. in there we have a yeah let's go in let's crawl in there we have a light on the secret Okay, Ring of Darkness, Resistance to Darkness, and two bottles. Unknown contents. Drink this. Oh, Alexi of Shadows. More. Oh, oh, oh. <coughs> okay, that's good. We can poison something. Oh, 
old knife is poisoned. Let's take this because I... Yeah. Artifact. Yeah, there's another of this guy. Survived 44 minutes, slain 20 monsters. That thing you don't have a map here, but this game is really promising. It is, it is really difficult, but yeah. I also found, found, found the exit basically, or go deeper into the dungeon. That's the easiest of all dungeons, to be honest. So, and it's only the demo. Go back to the main menu. Um, best heroes. Monsters of Dargraf, 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 swallowed by darkness. Yeah. We do have one achievement, and that is we lost to the damn traps. So I quickly show you the classes. So there's a blacksmith, which has a lot of strength and a good HP amount and your scroll balls and repair his equipment. And there's the warrior which has a lot of HP. A little less strong. And also use scroll balls. Has a better rage. The better rage means that after killing an enemy he gets buffed for like 80 seconds it was. So if you run through and kill monster after monster you get stronger every time. And he can sharpen his weapons without grindstone I think and there's the hunter uh, has, a uh, has a crossbow and he can place and disarm traps and the thief we just saw but that's it that's it for the demo with spark of the dark thanks for watching and uh, see you next time bye bye